Welcome back to Sur Assist. Adam here. Today I'm going to be giving you a brief overview of the Sura MLB cards. So stay tuned for that if you are interested in learning more about these cards. Do like this video, smash that like button and subscribe to the channel. If you're not signed up to Sura MLB yet, there is a link in the description below if you wish to do that. There's also a link in the description to sign up to the football version of Sura as well. This link gives you an option to sign up to either one of those or even both if you did wish to do that. Okay then, let's get straight stuck into today's content then. As I say, I'm just going to give you a quick guide of the Sura cards in terms of the Sura MLB cards. So on Sura MLB, there's four different card scarcities. There's the unique card, which is obviously just one of those for each player each season, which is depicted by the black colour here. There's also 100 of each player for each season in the super rare cards then there's 1000 of each player for each season of the rare cards which is depicted by the red color here and then finally we have the limited cards which is depicted by the yellow color and there's 5000 of those for each player for each season now of course there is also the common cards as well which are these white cards that you can see here there is an infinite supply of these cards and these cards are not nfts like the other four cards that are on screen now on so rare nft is a non-fungible token basically means it cannot be replicated and is a piece of digital property each card as well as their own personal serial number for each season for each player which we're going to go on to now now as you can see there's quite a lot of information on the player cards including the player's name the logo that the player plays for the type of scarcity of the card is represented by the colour. We also have the player's position and other relevant information. So let's have a look at the player card information in a little more detail. As you can see at the top right here we've got the so rare logo that we're all used to now. We've obviously got a picture of the player as well that this card represents. And if you see in the background we can see that it also says rare as well on the back of this player portrait. But as we know we can also tell the scarcity of the card by the colour card Red is obviously the rare cards, blue is the super rare, black is the unique and yellow is the limited cards. There's also the common cards as well of course, which you get 13 of when you sign up. We've also got here the season card as well, so as you can see this is for the season 2022. We've got the logo as well of the team that Aaron Judge plays for. We've also got the serial number here, so this is serial number 2 of 1000. Because Each season there's only 1000 rare cards of each player. So this is number two of 1000. We've then got the player's name here and also the positions that this player can play at the bottom of the card. Which tells us that Aaron Judge is an outfield player and also a designated hitter as well for the New York Yankees. And at the bottom we've got this nice little strip here that says year one edition. This basically means that this is the first year edition of the so rare MLB cards of Aaron Judge. This is obviously going to be the same for all the cards that released in the 2022 season. Some other things to note about cards as well, you can also see their season average score here and also their XP percentage. So this is based on the rarity, so because this is a rare card, the rare cards will get a plus 10 rarity bonus. And cards that are also from the current season, which this one of Aaron Judge is, they also get a 5% bonus as well. And this full bonus of 15% will be added to the player's score each game week. Now to buy the cards on So Rare, you can obviously go on the market, which, which is located here at the top left, New Card Sales. This will bring you to an auction screen where you can buy cards off the market. And it's on an auction, a bit like eBay, where you can see the time ticking down and then you can bid on that card. I did wish to put a bid in for one of your favourite players. You can also filter this by different scarcities as well, by limited, rare or super rare, just after a particular type of card. There's also another number of filters here at the bottom on the left here of the screen, I did want to filter it even more. You can also buy cards on the manager sales section as well, so this is where managers will sell their cards that they have purchased. And then once you've bought your cards, or got your 13 free ones on the draft when you sign up to Sir Rare MLB, you can then view them in my cards section here at the top, and this will show you all the cards that you have in your collection. As you can see at the moment, I've just got some common cards in my collection so far. Again, you can have, you've got these similar filters at the bottom here. So I'm sure you'll agree, these MLB so rare cards looks absolutely fantastic. So what are you waiting for? 
Get involved with the server MLB today. There is a link in the description below if you did want to get signed up. You will get 13 of the white coloured common cards when you do that. You'll also get to pick a star player as well, which could potentially be Aaron Judge. Okay, thanks for watching. Smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you again soon.